Hey guys, it's Santosh again. Welcome to another video. In this series, we will be seeing about OCI, it's Oracle Cloud Infrastructure. We will be seeing about the design language and the architecture and what are the various services provided by Oracle Cloud. So stay tuned. Please do like the video and do subscribe to our channel and do click the bell icon and you will be getting notification each and every time I post a new video. And the dates of Oracle Cloud Infrastructure exam has been extended. So you can use this opportunity to learn the cloud and as well as get certified. So stay tuned. You can find the link in the description box below and register yourself for the exam. And I will be discussing also how you can approach the exam and what are the different uh, areas you should concentrate. So stay tuned. And let's get this video started. So what you see is the simple architecture diagram of a single region of Oracle Cloud. So in each and every region, there are three different ADs. ADs are nothing but physical data centers. Every region has three ADs. There exists single AD region two. In case in India, there is two single AD regions. One is in Mumbai and one is in Hyderabad. So we will be seeing about what is AD and FD in detail. FTs are virtual uh, separations of a single database. In each and every AD, you have three FDs. FDs are fault domains. Fault domains are logical separations of a single data center. And each and every fault domain, you see compute services and database running. C denotes compute service and DB denotes database service. Each and every database and compute service are duplicated across all the three FDs to provide high reliability and high scalability. And there are some cool features where you can leverage in OCI. Let's take we are in a multiple AD region and if a disaster occurs in a single place of a region, let's say in a power failure. A power failure can affect multiple ADs but in this case we will be seeing uh, how it affects uh, multiple ADs. So if in case AD1 fails and uh, this uh, compute services won't be running and there is a cool service that you can uh, leverage in OCI. You can always keep the service running on different ADs so that if there is a power failure or natural disaster in a single AD and you will always have multiple ADs to support uh, your uh, application and the service will be keep on running and you can see all the services all the compute services and the database services are duplicated across all the ADs in a single region this is also done to improve the high reliability and high scalability if you have any doubts on these please leave it in the comment section so that I can answer if you want more clarification on any of the part please do mention that in the comment below and we will be seeing about ADs, FDs, compute services, database services, security services, identity service and there are six services in total and we will be seeing about each and everything in detail so stay tuned stay home stay safe